Welcome to our tech tutorial. Today, we're tackling a question that many new developers encounter when working with Log4j. Our viewer is eager to learn how to configure their logging setup to display only info and error messages in their log files. Let's dive into their configuration and see how we can achieve this. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll go through your question, go through the answers for it, and hopefully that brings you to your solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy to get to that solution just like me. And let's get started. To display only info and error messages in your log file using log4j, we need to adjust the logging levels in your properties file. First, locate the line that defines the root logger. Currently, it is set to all. We will change this to log only info and error levels. Next, we need to ensure that the file appender is also set to log messages at the info level. This will filter out any messages below this level. Now, let's summarize the final configuration. Your properties file should look like this to achieve the desired logging behavior. With these changes, your log4j setup will now only log info and error messages to the specified log file. Test it out to see the results. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To display only info and error messages in your log file, set the threshold for the file appender to info. For more details, check out related resources on Stack Overflow and the official Log4j documentation. And that's it guys. I hope this video helped get you the answer that you're looking for. Now, I'll see you next time. Please subscribe for more question and answer videos. And if you have any more, please shoot them through in the comments. Have a good one.